Like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. 10 fast food hacks that you didn't know about. With everyone indoors due to the ongoing pandemic, this is probably the one time in history that everyone's ordering fast food. And I mean just about everyone. Besides, who wants to go out and potentially put themselves or their families at risk? Not me. So while staying at home, I developed an amazing strategy of how to get more quality, and obviously quantity, from all my fast food orders. In fact, today, I'll be sharing with you 10 awesome fast food hacks you can capture capitalize on to turn your fast food into full food. From McDonald's to Chipotle to Subway, find out how you can get more bang for your buck. Number one, ask for fresh fries. Mmm, fries. They're the Robin to every Batman, the perfect sidekick in a fast food meal. French fries are what makes a meal even more memorable and satiating. As a rule of thumb, I always ask the attendant to pack me a fresh serving of french fries every time I place an order at McDonald's. I also make sure to tell them to pack my fries without any salt. As the tale goes, you'll get a fresh batch of fries, as they normally come salted. But you don't need to make the employees clean the fry basket and equipment to get a fresh batch. If the restaurant isn't busy, just ask for fresh fries. It's easier for the employees to make a fresh, salted batch than it is for them to make fresh, unsalted ones. But hey, if they're in good mood, I guarantee you'll enjoy it. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take 5 seconds to complete. So here's the deal, you just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you will get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it, it really works! Number 2. Order a 20 piece McNugget I've had a lot of time to try out nearly every meal option at my local McDonald's, and with all this to go by, I guarantee you that you can never go wrong with McNuggets. Yep, McNuggets are the perfect option for chicken lovers and those who have a special connection with dipping sauces. So if you're looking to get more value for your dollar, you can never go wrong with the 20 piece McNugget order instead of the 10 piece option. A 10 piece McNuggets usually costs one and a half dollars less than the 20 piece order. That's double the number of nuggets for less than $2. I don't know about you, but wouldn't you want to have more pieces for nearly the same price? Number 3. Ask for half of each filling at Chipotle When it comes to healthier fast food options, you can never go wrong with Chipotle. So, I decided to order the rice and beans a couple of times, and this is what I found out. When asked what type of rice and beans you want, say half and half. A majority of the time, they will give you nearly double what they would have if you only said one type. The same applies to protein, where you can ask for half and half, but they will only charge you for the price of the more expensive meat. How awesome is that? Number 4. Skip the protein and get free guacamole at Chipotle Still leaning on the healthier options? Great! There's nothing better than a side of guac when you don't have to pay extra for it. When you're at Chipotle, if you pass on meat or the sofritas protein option, you get a healthy, satiating guacamole serving free of charge. If you're not willing to skip out on the protein and want to add the guacamole, ask for it on the side. They tend to give you more on the side than if they put it on your burrito. Another Chipotle hack, if you get a burrito bowl, you can still get a tortilla on the side free of charge. Boy, it's easy to fall in love with Chipotle. Number 5. Order a foot long at Subway So the foot long has been gone for a couple of years, but it's making its way back due to popular demand. Heck, you probably remember hearing the commercial for Subway's $5 footlongs. I'll be the first to say that it was one hell of a catchy jingle. While not ordering every footlong sandwich is $5, ordering a footlong sub is still cheaper than ordering two 6 inches. A 12 inch sandwich is a lot for one sitting, but you can always share it with a friend or save it for later. But hey, if you're a one-man army, then you definitely can't go wrong with Subway's nutritious footlong. Number 6. Order a triple espresso on ice for a cheaper iced latte There's no better way to start your day than with an iced latte. 
However, this drink can be a little pricey when it doesn't have to be. To save nearly $2 on your next coffee order at Starbucks, ask for a triple espresso on ice in a large cup. After you get your drink, head over to the condiment area to add milk and anything else you might like. It's worth noting though that this hack might not work during the pandemic as Starbucks is doing takeouts only right now. Ice and cold cups aren't options when you order an espresso shot in the Starbucks app for pickup ahead of time, and you might not be able to add milk to your drink yourself while stores are closed. Bummer, right? Number 7. Order using the brand's mobile app Nowadays, you can do anything on your phone, from ordering groceries and watching movies to pre-ordering food from your favorite fast food chains. Many fast food chains have a mobile application where customers can earn freebies. Who doesn't like free food? When you download the Dairy Queen app, for example, you can get a free small blizzard. If you join My Panera Rewards, you get a free pastry. And rewards programs from chains like Noodles & Company and Domino's will earn you points for every purchase that you can redeem for free food. You don't even need a smartphone app. You can add your purchases to your account through a computer and a web browser. While it might not seem like a lot, you'll be saving a few bucks and enjoying a sweet treat at the same time. Other fast food restaurants like Chipotle, Wendy's, Burger King, McDonald's, Subway, Krispy Kreme, and Baskin Robbins offer exclusive deals solely in their apps, so make sure you have them all downloaded before you go. Number 8. Consider a kid's meal Chipotle offers kids' meals for children, but you don't have to be a child to enjoy these options. You can build a meal with rice, beans, steak, and two tortillas for only five bucks. You might also be able to get some sides, such as sour cream and corn for free this way, depending on the location. And Chipotle isn't the only fast food or fast casual restaurant with kids' meal options. McDonald's Happy Meals and the kids' meals at Wendy's, Chick-fil-A, and Burger King are suitable as portion-sized adult meals. And now we've come to the best pick of the day. Boy, I love me some Subway sandwiches. They always seem to get the sauces just right to give you a cocktail of succulent pleasure in your mouth. Oh, excuse me, I got a little carried away there. Might as well go ahead and make a future order right now, huh? Number 9. Order Pour Over Coffee at Starbucks If Starbucks isn't too crowded, especially once we can get back inside their cafes, try ordering a pour over coffee rather than a cup of drip. Oh, and let's also not forget that you can ask them for French press coffee too. Just know that this will take longer, so it's best to try it when the store isn't crowded and you as well as the baristas have time to spare. Number 10. Ask for an Old Style Sandwich at Subway There's nothing quite worse than going to bite into a piled high sub and having the topping spill out of the sides. Not only is it annoying, but it essentially turns your sub into a salad. If you're looking to keep all of your toppings in the sub, when you order at Subway, ask the employee for an Old Style Sandwich. This way, they'll cut the sub in a V-slice from the top to create a boat-like crevice for your toppings so they stay put. And if they don't know what you mean, you can explain how you want the bread to be cut. So there you have it. Bet your behind will be on the couch all day surfing through fast food mobile apps, huh? After learning all these fast food hacks, do you know of any personal fast food hacks you personally use to get more bang for your buck? Let us know in the comment section down below. And want more videos that'll exist until the very end of time? Click on any of the amazing videos that you see on your screen. And as always, thank you all so very much for watching.